Liverpool to Portsmouth, yeah, that chorus, the crowd screaming. What's going on, people? Fame Entertainment here from the Inner Circle. If you missed my last video, please go back and check it out. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, go in the comment section down below, positive and negative feedback is always welcome. So please, let your voice be heard. Now, we just found out that the price for PlayStation Plus is going up $10 from $49.99 to $59.99. Now, one leverage that I believe uh, Sony had over PlayStation Plus and uh, Xbox Live was the price difference. Though, most people, I believe like myself, didn't pay $60 a year for Xbox Live. There are lots of places uh, CD keys or you can follow a cheap ass gamer on Twitter. There's always a site new egg somewhere That's selling a 12-month subscription to Xbox live for cheaper than 60 But now that the uh, Sony has officially j uh, Jacked their prices up to the same as Xbox live. I I'm starting to feel as if Sony is getting entirely too comfortable I mean, what is the reasoning behind raising the price? Um, is it to go inside the servers infrastructure? I mean, what is the reason besides matching what Microsoft is doing? Let's be honest here guys paying to pay online is complete crap Anyway, and these two services aren't all that hot. I mean, yes uh, Microsoft has gotten better got gotten better with their free and not really free games um, Over the past few months and PlayStation continues to give us stuff that most people don't care about. I believe even next month's selection was revealed and it was, wasn't all that hot. So, I mean, oh, well, I'm sorry, this month wasn't all that hot. I think next month hasn't been revealed yet. Uh, but I, I just thought they've gotten way too comfortable. And this is what happens when a fan base doesn't speak out against what a company is doing. Uh, think about what Xbox had, had tried to do, or the things they tried to implement, and the fan base was vocal. And they changed the mind. But with PlayStation, people seem to be okay with it. I've seen people even defending it. Saying, oh, it's just 10 bucks. Why does everybody care? And they immediately go, well, Xbox is the same price. This has nothing to do with Xbox. It has nothing to do with it. You guys should not be just okay with the price going up by $10. I don't, I don't want to hear it. It's just 10 bucks. You shouldn't be okay with that. You know, and I said it before in different videos, it is it is up to Microsoft in a way to make this all go away. Microsoft started this. They did. Microsoft said, you know what, let's put up a paywall and make them pay to play. And so Sony was like, shoot, we'll make them pay to play. You know, Microsoft's like, all right, we're going to make it 60 bucks a year. Sony was like, all right, we'll make it 60 bucks a year. So if... Xbox, hopefully with the extra money they're going to be getting in with all these games going to Windows uh, PC via Windows 10, hopefully they can use that money to in turn make multiplayer free. Because if Microsoft makes multiplayer free, it will force Sony's hand and they will have to do the same. They copied them on every other avenue, they will have to copy them on this. Do you guys think Sony is getting entirely too comfortable with the lead that they have? And do you, do you guys, are you guys okay with just paying the extra $10, you know, um, not $10 a month. I might say that three times. Extra $10 for your, you know, yearly subscription. This is Fame Entertainment from the Inner Circle. You guys have a great one. And I'm out.